Thanks for joining us here on the DenverChannel.com. I'm 70s meteorologist Maureen McCann. Beautiful start to the day in Netherlands. Look at those clouds hanging over the mountain tops, being carved by the upper level winds. They're at 8,000 feet. So it's a, a nice start to the day. It's going to be another hot afternoon, especially on the plains with 90s in store once again. And it looks like it's going to stay this way right through the holiday weekend. The only hope for some uh, cooler weather from the short term will be from the afternoon showers and thunderstorms. This 12 hour loop indicates that yesterday afternoon they flared up to the west of the divide, especially and north of I 70. Today will look very similar. There's only a small chance that one or two of those could drift down to the plains. Future cast unwinding through Sunday indicates that there still could be some downpours in the southwestern part of the state and also going up through the Arkansas Valley. But the front range should be dry, especially the eastern plains, where, can, where we will continue to have the high fire danger as a result. So 90s appear on the map once again. Denver 92, that will make it day number 68 in the 90s this year. 60s and 70s appear in the mountains, like for Leadville, a little bit cooler there compared to the 70s in Breckenridge, Winter Park, and Vail. Remember to bring the extra layers if you're going to be camping tonight because cooler lows will drop to the 30s and 40s there. So your planner for today, 92 degrees, sun giving way to clouds, maybe some storms in the afternoon, especially for the mountains. Better chance for storms closer to home here in Denver by Tuesday and Wednesday as a cold front comes through. Look what that does to our temperatures. We slide back through the 80s with 70s on the way by next weekend. Thanks for watching. Hope you're having a great holiday weekend.